Hey guys, Radio Garage back on the bench. I uh, got a Connex 33 HPC1. Uh, got sent in. Gonna unbox it here quick in front of everybody. Open it up and see what we got to start with. So here we go. Okay, so let's uh, let's hook up the regulated supply. Let's just make sure that nothing happened in shipping here. Just gonna put it on uh, regulate it. She's looking good so far. Yep, just around about a quarter of an amp. That's normal for uh, normal for idling, for idle current. Okay. Carrier, here we go. Carrier looks good. We're doing about what's that? Eight watts. We're reading that top scale, 50 watt slug. We're gonna throw audio into it. Yeah, that's what you got there, Mr. T. All right, there's your issue. She's totally flat topped and pinched. So there you have it. Initial testing. Let's get that off of there. All right. So now you know. You know why you sound it the way you did. Uh, I'm gonna hook up the mic here. You said you were running a uh, 636 Estatic, so that's what I'm gonna use for the testing. Turn that on peak, 50 watt slug. Let's just see what she's doing with all that dirty power. Hello, one, two, three, four, five. Audio, one, two, three, four, five. Audio, one, two, three, four, 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 four. So she's doing job between 30 and 35 on the peak. Um, like I said, we're at about an eight watt dead key. Uh, which, you know, the dead key is not, not an issue. Uh, medium you're at. And just about 4 watts of here under 4. And low you're at. And 2 watts on low, so. And you're not too concerned about that. You don't run anything after, uh, in line with this. So, all right. So that's that. That's the initial testing. Um, to put it on the receive here quick. Calm. We're gonna try to get her down to 12. These you generally have good receive on them. Connexes. I always like the way these receive. Um, 
Yeah, this one's going to have a good receiver on it. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, 12 dB right there, and you're you're at negative 105. So we'll see if we can improve it all on that. You know, that's that's a really good start already. But um, yeah, we'll see what we can do. We'll drop that down a little more for you. Um, so so that's that. All right. There's your initial initial testing. And uh, I'm going to get busy with the tune-up and alignment for you. And uh, I'm going to see. You said there was a problem with the external speaker jack. Let's see if I could hear it. Uh, let's see if it's going to do it for me or not. I don't know, see. Seems like it's working alright. Might be going in and out a little bit, but I don't really hear anything crazy with it. Yeah, we'll see what we find. Alright. We'll be back, and when we are, we shall have a much better radio in front of you. So, stay tuned. Okay, Mr. T, we got your Connex uh, CX33 HPC1 all done. Came out wonderful. And luckily, uh, the couple problems that you wanted me to address um, kind of straightened themselves out on their own. So uh, that always helps both of us. Um, once the levels um, on the modulation came down to where they should have been, your talk back cleaned up and also I'm going to show you something else with the talk back um, to keep in mind to uh, to help with um, squealing or distortion and uh, the speaker jack I didn't find um, I didn't have any problems with the speaker jack with the external speaker um, I'll show you that right now before we get started I'm sure you could hear that, and I'll wiggle that jack around in the back. So, I'm not having any problems with the external. Um, so, maybe I'm, I'm thinking maybe you might have had a speaker issue or something or something on your end there. But, anyways. Let's get on with it. Uh, we're going to start with the transmit side. All right. And we're going to do our normal uh going to do our normal AM carrier. We're in AM. Uh, this is an AM FM rig. Let's see mic gain. Mic gain's all the way up, guys. We got power on high. All right. that okay came out really nice beautiful so we'll disconnect that much better looking I think and then we will come over here we'll put the plug in we'll take this off peak and we'll show you where you're where your carrier levels are, you're still on high. So uh, on high you're going to have a carrier 50 watt slug, 8 watts. Okay, medium, carrier, 3 watts, and low, carrier, just under 2 watts. Alright, mic gain all the way up. The power back to high, engage the peak, 50 watt slug, top scale. I'm sorry, um, center scale, center scale. One, two, three, four, five, 
One, two, three, four, 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 four. Just over 30 on the peaks. All right, which comes out perfect with the 8-watt dead key. Nice 4 to 1. Okay, so that's that on the transmit. Um, let's see, we will go to, let's see, we did the, um, we'll do the receiver. Get you on over to the receiver test there, do the sign out. All right, and here's the receive. And we got the left column there, looking for 12 dB. Okay, she's bouncing a little bit between 12 and 11. Um, yeah, it's holding totally steady. Yeah, there she goes at 12 again. Um, picked up another 5 uh, 5 dB there for you. All right, we're negative 110. So I mean, I thought 105 was really good. Um, I actually tuned it tuned it up a little bit more for you. Um, generally, don't get them this hot. Uh, came out really nice. 110 on the negative. 12 or I'm sorry negative 110 with the 12 dB of cyanide all right so so basically what that means is you got a a nice low noise floor and you're going to definitely be hearing down very very low let's see where that tone falls out Take it down to 120. Actually, let's go to 125. Yeah, you could hear it there when I switched the channel, so um, it's still in at negative 125, which, uh, if you go into microvolts, that comes down to. Yeah, you're hearing down to 0.1. All right, you're hearing down to 0.125 microvolts. You can't beat that. So, um, that's what that converts over to. So that's the receive. Came out beautiful, beautiful. Um, these have the shock keys from the factory, guys. So, there's really nothing as far as upgrades to do with these it's more it's all in the tuning for these so um, that's how that goes alright we'll be back okay and let's get it hooked up to the um, to the spectrum analyzer here we'll take a trip take a trip over to the spectrum analyzer get that plugged in there we'll get ourselves set up over this way Alright, and we're going to do, uh, do, 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 do 15, 15 megahertz span, center 27205, starts 197, and stops 347 megs. Okay, okay, in the mic, nice and clean, got two little, two little tiny blips there, uh, about negative 20, about negative 20 dB down. Halo, one, two, three, four, five. Halo, one, two, three, four, five. Nice and clean. Take it out to 30. All right. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Oh, looking good there. Um, so that's the spectrum analyzer. Came out nice and clean. And we're back. Want to do a quick uh, frequency check for you. Got my jumper hooked up now. Didn't have that hooked up before. Channel 20. All right. Gonna key it up. You just give it a second. At yeah, 27, 204, 90s. Okay. It takes a while for it to come up on there, but it came up um, finally. So 27, 204, 9, close, close enough. Channel 20. Um, now, the other thing I wanted to touch base with you on was the talk back. So let me show you um, what I meant by that. 
I'm gonna take this back out. I'm gonna put it on my dummy load here. And let me hook up my I hook up my cheapy my cheapy external over there to the left. Let's let you see what it sounds like. So put the talk back on. Um, there's about a quarter. Quarter of the way on. Put this up a little bit. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. No squealing. Um, really nice and clear. We'll push it a little more. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And push it a little more. About three quarters. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So it's still not squealing. I mean, you can hear it starting to distort a little bit. Um, maybe you can go. Let's see if it'll take it all the way. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so it did take it all the way, but let me just show you the difference with the good external speed. This is my. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I think you could tell. That's what it all the way up. You're not squealing at all. No distortion. Crank that volume up. Cut that white noise down. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see, could she take it all the way, volume? One, two, three, four, five. So there you go. Volume all the way up. Talk back all the way up. No squeals. Perfect. Um, so there's that. I just wanted to explain that to you. Because if you do have a low quality speaker, um, that, that could be part of the issue too. So just wanted to go over that. And I think that's... Uh, gonna be it showed you the transmit showed you the receive um, showed you it's on frequency spectrum analyzer I uh, could let's see I could show you let you hear it over the air here on the monitor radio okay I got the external speaker hooked up for the monitor radio it gives you a much better idea of what somebody else is gonna hear you like over the air so um, once again uh, mic in all the way up I do have the echo on for this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, I got a little too much echo. I'm gonna turn that off. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Hello, one, two, three. So, really, really nice audio coming out of this thing. Beautiful audio. So I think you're gonna be real happy with it. I know you're gonna be happy with it. So I appreciate the appreciate the business. Appreciate everybody tuning in. Hopefully you guys stuck around for the duration. I know it was a long video, but, uh, you know, got to get everything in. Got to try to uh, show stuff, explain stuff. Make sure uh, you subscribe and leave me a comment. If you have any comments or questions or need anything answered, there's my contact information, radiogaragegmail.com. Appreciate it. We're off the key.